Hey guys, I'm Tommy. It's Randy. We cover Iowa State sports for the Des Moines Register, and we just got done watching what turned out to be Iowa State's last men's basketball this game of the season. Comes to an end with a loss to Virginia in the Sweet 16. Randy, Iowa State struggled from start to finish. Iowa State did the unpardonable sin. You cannot get behind a team like Virginia. A slowpoke team like Virginia, they play slow offense. The key to the game for Iowa State was getting a lead, getting a significant lead to force Virginia to play Iowa State's quicker pace. That didn't happen. It was 12 to two or something like that. It was a 17 point lead very early in the game for Virginia and it was, Iowa State was, was forced into playing Virginia's game, which is lull you to sleep and then watch the guys dribble by you. Another big game for George Niang final game for George Niang, a uh, very emotional ending for him. Yeah, exactly. He blew a kiss to the to the fans after the game, very similar to the Iowa game a couple of years ago. But yeah, he went out with 30 points. He went out with, with style. Um, he had played most of the game in foul trouble. I mean, that's George's deal. He gets in foul trouble. And, um, but to Prom's credit, he kept him in there as much as he could during throughout the whole game. Um, yeah, George had 30 points, 28 points, and 28 points in this NCAA tournament. So I defy you to, you know, to find many guys who are having better NCAA tournaments um, than him. It's uh, you were in the locker room, I was in the locker room. What was your, what was your 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 immediate take when you when you were in that locker room? It's a very cramped locker room. <laughs> uh, typical loss. Uh, I, you know, obviously this is a team that had some pretty high hopes. I think the overwhelming feeling from talking to everybody is. Uh, they didn't accomplish everything they wanted to do, uh, whether it was during the regular season or the postseason in the Big 12 tournament and the NCAA tournament. I still think it was a successful season, though. Um, number one, Naz Long didn't play. I mean, so if he's playing, they're going to win some of those close games. Number two, a transition year, Fred to Prom. Prom had a better season. Prom's had a better transition year than Fred certainly is having. So in that respect, I think it was a successful season. It wasn't a great season. So anyway, so Tommy and I are writing stories right now as, as we speak, and, and we'll have more stories as the days um, come up on, on you know, season-ending stories with Iowa State basketball. So for the Des Moines Register and DesMoinesRegister.com, he's Tommy and I'm Randy.